Challenge. My name is Amber and I am so excited to share with you guys this beautiful, beautiful wig from Continental Wigs. This is a Belle Madame and this is Angelina. I love, love, love this wig. I've been wearing her around and I not only feel like this color is absolutely gorgeous, but these beautiful beachy waves and this wig is just stunning. I am so thrilled to be sharing this line of hair with you guys. It's a very high-end European wig line. Um, the Belle Madame brand is hard to come by and Continental has a wide selection with a good amount of beautiful colors to choose from. So I love sharing for this awesome company. And this wig is probably my favorite so far out of the gorgeous wigs that I have shared from the Belle Madame line. They're all awesome. It's really hard to say I have a favorite, but there's just something so wonderful about this beachy natural look. I also think that if I had my natural hair color, it would be probably close to this shade. I was a blondie as a child and then it slowly went darker. Um, granted, it probably wouldn't be as warm as this, but um, my natural hair color would probably be a dark blonde. So to move on with it and not blab too much, this is, like I said, Belle Madame from Continental Wigs. And this wig that I'm sharing with you today is Angelina Mono SF. And this gorgeous, gorgeous color that I'm sharing with you guys today is Caramel Root. And the code for that is 122720 root eight. Now let's talk about this gorgeous color. When I first pulled it out, I thought kind of brown, kind of blonde, very warm. I don't know. Oh, ooh. see, I've been brown for so long that blondes kind of scare me a little. I think that this is just a beautiful in between shade because you do have a little bit of that darker root. And then it's so beautiful with the warmth. So let's let's talk about that. Take a look up close. One thing I love about the Belle Madame line is that their fibers are so soft and fine. This is synthetic, but they're so soft and delicate. They really feel and look like human hair. So beautiful. So with this color, you have your number eight root. So you have a, you know, medium brown number eight root. I do like that because I do have, you know, medium brown bio hair, which I do have my perimeter down here pulled out. And look how well that blends. It looks like it's just so natural with my bio hair. Looks so good if my hair was to blow in the wind and I have just slightly, a tiny bit of my perimeter pulled out and it looks awesome. Then what you have is a 12, which is your blonde highlights and a 27, which is almost an auburn color that you see here. And that's what gives it the warmth, almost an auburny look to it. And then you have your 20 and that's just blended. Your 12, 27 and 20 is all blended nicely together, giving you that very warm, auburn, blonde feel to it with that eight root graduating into the rest of the color. And what I love about the rooting in these Belle Madame wigs is that it looks so natural. looks so good and you can see all those gorgeous shades mixed in with the hair creating such beautiful dimension and beautiful natural looking color i would definitely say that caramel root is a fantastic name for this shade because it does have that caramel warm blonde auburn rich color to it now about this wig, it's so beautiful because it has these gorgeous layers and then just waterfalls into these loose, beachy, beachy waves all throughout. I mean, it's just so natural looking. The movement is awesome. Oh, 
I just love it. What you have here is a nine inch bang. You have about 10 inches in the crown. And I would say that this is probably 18 to 20 inches or so in length. This wig feels very comfortable and it looks so natural, not only because of the very fine fibers, but they also have their super front lace. That is their delicate, very fine knotting, their amazing front lace. I mean, look how fantastic that lace front looks. I feel like it looks so good. So when you see an SF on your Belmadam line wigs, that means it has your super front. I feel like this looks absolutely incredible for a front lace. You also have a full monotop and I'll show you guys the inside of the cap when I take this wig off. Let me show you guys a full turnaround. I pulled this out of the box and I was like, ah, with the color. And then when I put it on, I was like, eh, it's so great because of the style. And then I looked at that lace front and I was like, oh, because holy cow, it looks amazing. Okay, so now I'm gonna pull this off and show you guys the inside of the cap. Ooh, I look fantastic under there. So what's nice is their super front lace is pretty deep, which gives you fantastic area for parting and styling. And then you have your monofilament top, which is also great for multi-directional parting and styling. And that is all hand tied. Now I'm looking at this right here. It looks like a very, very small section of this wig. As you can see right here, does have an itsy bitsy bitsy little tiny amount of permatease. That is just very, very minimal on the far back crown area. And I didn't even know it was there until now, actually, um, you know, through investigating this cap. And I actually think that they did a very fine job with this permatease. Some people are so against permatease, but I think that with certain wigs, it can really give some great volume and um, some lift in those roots. And for this Angelina wig, I think it's gorgeous. I mean, it looks so beautiful with this, this wave and this cut and this style. Um, I didn't even know it was there. So take note of that. The remaining body of that wig is open wefted, which creates very breathable ventilation, keeps you nice and cool. You have your velvet ear tabs and your velvet nape. And then you have your straps that you can adjust to make that wig fit truer to size. These wigs are very well made, um, very comfortable, very high quality. I've been more than pleased with every Belmadam wig I have reviewed for Continental Wigs. Now I'm gonna put this back on and give you guys a little bit more information. So like I said, one thing that makes these wigs even more realistic, if you do have a little bit of bio hair, is incorporating some of the front perimeter or any area of your bio hair if you do have some. If not, these wigs look fantastic regardless. Um, but because I do have a little bit of bio hair, um, incorporating that perimeter works well and because of the dark root, it, it also works well. It blends pretty well. With this type of wig, it's really fun to do creative styling. You have the length, you have the wave. It's really easy to pull up in a pretty updo, do a braid, um, pull it half up. There's a lot of fun things you can do with this and it's really easy because of the gorgeous built-in wave. It's ready to wear out of the box. Um, it's just lovely. Don't be scared to try fun things. Add accessories, whether that be a headband, a clip, you know, add some cute braids. There's so many things you can do with your wigs to spruce them up, add some personality. I mean, of course they're gorgeous with nothing at all, just plopping them on, but have a little fun with them and don't be scared.
Now what I think I'm going to do with Angelina is add a few braids. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to part Angelina And you don't even have to have a precise parting because you have your very deep lace and you have your monofilament. Now what I'm going to do is I think I want a little bit of some bang. So I'll leave a little bit down and grab a section and split it in three like so now I'm going to try a waterfall braid I don't know if this is gonna work out but the trick to a waterfall braid is actually dropping your bottom piece um, braiding like a normal braid, but dropping the normal piece each time, creating the waterfall look. So let's let's check this out. Cross over, grab a piece of hair, let go of the strand, and grab a new piece. We'll see how this works. Grab a piece of hair, let go of the strand, grab a new piece. <sighs> grab a piece of hair, let go of the strand, grab a new piece. Grab a piece of hair, let go of your strand, and grab a new piece. Grab a piece of hair, grab a new strand, let go of your strand. Oops, I don't even know what I'm saying, guys, but you get it, right? <laughs> What I lo also love about these fibers on the Belle Madame line is that you have a lot of hair on these wigs, but they are light. So styling is easy. Pulling it up, braiding, it's not so bulky that things slide out. It's not so bulky that it's hard to pull up. You really can have fun and it's not too much if that makes sense what i'm going to do is grab a cute clip i don't even know what it looks like in the back this is a guessing game make sure that when you are clipping bobby pins or clips into your wig that you are mindful of your hand tied areas of course if you are clipping in the back around those wefted areas you can slide your bobby pins and your clips into those wefted areas but if you're clipping up here where the delicate hand tied super front lace or mono top is, you want to be mindful and not puncture those delicate base materials. Another thing to maintain those fibers is to use more of a wide tooth comb. That's going to be a lot more gentle on those fibers. Well, that's fun and kind of boho looking. What do you guys think? I love this style with these beachy waves. I think it's really cute. And you could take it as far as then pulling it half up, taking some bobby pins and pinning it up. You'd have your braid to the side and then more of a updo, uh, creating something exceptionally fancy. Um, but for today, I think that I like it down with that braid, and I think it looks super, super cute. I almost forgot to point out the total weight for this wig is 4.27 ounces. 
And you guys, you can always get free shipping over at Continental Wigs using the code FAB3. I will have all the links down below for this Angelina wig by Belle Madame. Take note that Continental Wigs has a huge selection of wigs in other brands as well. And they're a great company with fantastic customer service. They're really down to earth and they can help you with any of your needs. If you guys have any questions, you can comment below, you can contact me, or you can certainly contact Continental Wigs with any of your questions or concerns. Let me know what you think about this Angelina wig. What do you think about this color? I think I really love it. Oh my goodness. Ooh, I love this rich shade. This caramel color is speaking to me. It's so beautiful. And um, if you guys are looking for more styling tips, let me know. Give me a thumbs up and comment below. All right, that is all for today. Until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye.